Hey everyone, welcome to the fifth episode of Art Yacht where we have artists revealing themselves, artists talking about art while doing art, and who we have today. My name is YK Osiris. And what you do? I'm an actor on Disney Channel. Girl, what's your favorite Disney Channel show? Probably uh, Good Luck Charlie. Five kids. Five kids. Yeah. Okay. What's your top Disney right now? Top two. Top, top, top three. Top three. Shows or movies? Movies. Disney movies. What's that one where it's the dude? He a ghostwriter for his homeboy. Let it shine. Let it shine. More than a crush. More than a light like. More than a love. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Is that, that's a Disney movie? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, I like Nemo And uh, I watched I watch Ratatouille like Probably like 500 times Do I like to rap? I don't like snitches Okay so we have a new segment This is the first time we're going to do this segment It's called Getting to Know Art Where I actually teach artists about art I know it's like Art Yap And we haven't teached anybody about art yet But we're going to start right now I think everybody has seen this so far Okay tell me how you feel about this How does this picture make you feel? Hmm Hmm I mean, it's naked women and like a, like it looks like ancient. I mean, how do you feel like aroused? Period. Okay, so this is the birth of Venus, right? It's a painting about Sandros. This painting is like very controversial for two reasons: because it's a naked woman. It's the first time ever somebody has painting a naked woman other outside of like a religious way because people will only paint naked women or naked people because of religious to represent the sin of eve so that was like mm. controversial like it was like this has nothing to do with religion so what about like statues and stuff that's like way afterward. later way later yeah that's like the mm. renaissance okay. but for this this is like the painting and it's controversial also because it's like on Tuscan, it's a Tuscan painting on a canvas. And usually Tuscan paintings are on wood. So it's like, how you did that on canvas, you know? So that's like controversial. Mm -hmm. Also, the second one is the goddess of love and beauty. So like she represents love and beauty. Also, it is a symbol of baptism. This whole painting is like of her coming out of the water and she's getting baptized and everything like that. So that's a little bit about this painting. How you feel about it? Nice. Would you write a song about it? I would not. Period. <laughs> okay, let's go to the third section. Um, with Jenga, we actually have questions and dare. So whatever Jenga piece that you pull out, you will have a question or you will have a dare and you have to pull. Hey, what was that? What was it? What was that freaky shit y'all was doing? Why you had a finger in your mouth? When did I have a finger in my mouth? It wasn't a finger in your mouth? No. Seth was all behind you, said, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a cough drop. <laughs> no, okay. That was a baby food. No, no, no. Y'all, look, I'm a woman of God. That was a one. Look, my PA did it. Like, my PA made up that there. Period. Period. PA, don't do that again at all. Yeah. That was, that's you? That was him. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, he did that. All right. Anyway. Disgusting. <laughs> Disgusting. We're gonna go ahead. Okay, look. So we have a dare. We have three dares. You have to do every single dare. I got to. You have to. Okay. If you don't, somebody gonna come in here and handle you. Shit, I got that dang on me, so we really good. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you really wanna you we we could we could do it. Alright, All right, now come on. We, you can go ahead first. I'm gonna let the guest pull you first. Okay. Uh uh. <laughs> What's your favorite animal? Explain why you'll fuck a sheep. Yeah. Why would you fuck a sheep? These are curated. <laughs> these are curated questions. <laughs> I already explained in the video. If you know, you got to put the clip on the screen. Yeah, it's it's a video of some thick ass sheep. It was a joke. 
it was a joke. But really, if you deprive a man for so long, that's the closest thing to something with a fat ass. Is them sheep. You gotta you gotta put you gotta put the video on the screen for them to understand. Right away. That video of them thick ass sheep, he was he was smacking the booty cheeks. Mm -hmm. Hey bro. What about a pig? I would never fuck an animal. Okay, but like if you had to If I had to, it would be that sheep. Okay. That's if valid. I had to. That's valid. Yeah. yeah. Just like you know what I'm saying? You don't got like a you don't got like an inanimate object or like a like a like a uh not an inanimate. You don't got like an animal you would have sex with if you had to. If I had to fuck an animal. A monkey is like the closest to a human. Makes sense. My turn. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, you have to put your piece on there. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, I knew that. Yeah, I played this game before. How come yours don't got a question? Oh. It's just me answering questions? <laughs> Hold, I just didn't put one with a question. So, okay. You know what? Yeah. Yeah. All I right. Can't win. All right, come on. Okay, your turn. Damn. What if I just, like, knock down the whole thing right now? Somebody gonna come in and handle you. A woman? No, it's a man. A man? Well, like a buff neck? Yeah. I'm not getting that piece. That piece not going. Ah. Uh, I like this. I like this. This this show that y'all doing. Really? I really like it. Like I feel it? like it's interactive. It's not boring. I've had a lot of interviews where it sucked. Like, it was just like, I, I want to go home. <laughs> Are you a homosexual? I'm a fucking homosexual. Justin B. Mention in Studio 713 tour. No, I am not a homo homosexual. Put in the clip. Huh? We're going to put in the clip. What's the clip? Of you saying you're a homosexual. When did I say that? In the 713 tour. I said that? Yeah. Oh. We were, just, we were just, like, confirming, like, so we know that you're not. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not homosexual. Yeah, he's not a homosexual, y'all. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Your turn. Okay. And see, you know what you grabbing, too. That's the funny thing. You know exactly what pieces you finna grab. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Who was the JP interlude about? My uh, my ex-girlfriend. Talk about it. What well, she was my, she was my first love. Mm -hmm. We was together for like two years, two and a half years. And then, um, yeah, we just, we just grew apart on some, on some sad shit. Really? Nobody cheated? Nah. Mm -mm. Would you get back with her? I would. But I feel like in order for that to happen, we, we have to grow as people. You know what I'm saying? Cause who we like it was no it was really a mutual separation, like the most mature breakup you could ever have with somebody. But she did try and get back with me. You said no? I said no. What? Cause I I knew we were gonna run into the same problems that we already had. Like we haven't enough time hasn't passed for us to have grown as people for us to really get back together and it work. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. So if you have one message right now to tell her, what would you tell her? Um, chase your dreams. <laughs> That's real. And love yourself. That's real. Damn, that question got me flustered. <laughs> oh, my God. Mm. My fault. Bitty bitty bomb bomb. Bitty bitty bomb bomb. Bitty yeah. bitty bomb bomb. What's your favorite Selena song? Do you listen to Selena? I don't. No. Oh shit. Okay. What's your song? Your favorite song? Period. Period. Uh, I mean, I'm a rapper, so like, my I listen to so much music that 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 my favorite song changes like every fucking two weeks. Like. Favorite rock song. Wait, do you listen to rock? I like some rock. Okay. I like um. The spot on my rays, I'm still just a rat in a I case. I forgot a bullet with butterfly wings by Smashing Pumpkins. I heard that. Or 19, I don't know. Oh. <laughs> What's my favorite strain? It's not strand. Why do people keep saying oh, wait, that? Is it not? It's not strand. What is it? Strand. Strain. Oh. Strand of weed. I got I used to, I was, I, I was a stoner from like 12 years old. I was smoking weed since 12. Damn. All the way up to like. 17, 18. I know I had a bad like acid trip and that fucked me up. So I just really 
every time I smoke weed, I feel like I'm on acid, so Damn. I really stay away from it. But I won't lie, like, it does make me lock in with the music. Like, not lock in as in focus, but it makes me, like, more creative. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So, but yeah, all in all, it's not worth it. I don't like smoking weed no more. Like, I literally just quit, like, two weeks ago. Mm. Okay. So you're sober completely? No, not sober. Oh, just off of weed? Off of weed, oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, so what happened off that um, acid trip? What happened? I was like 15. Damn. Um, we was with my mom. We didn't really have nowhere to stay, so we was like at a friend's house, sleeping on couches and shit. And uh, I don't know how I got my hands on it, but I fucked around, took that hell, yonk. No kicked in. It was good. It wasn't a bad trip. What 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 I where I fucked up was I smoked weed while oh, I was on the acid. Sense. So you know what I'm saying? The trip went like this. You know, and then it died down a little bit. I'm like, let's fucking bring it back up. So you know what I'm saying? I smoked I smoked a little bit more and then my toes felt like jelly. And I was just I was just losing my fucking mind. And like it felt like there was like a knot in my neck. But it wasn't, it, it just basically my nerve endings was all fucked up and I just couldn't, I was fucked up. Were you depressed at the time? At the time? Yeah. Nah. Really? Mm -mm. Because usually when you take like psychedelics, it goes based off your mindset. So it's like, if you're like in a bad mindset, that's how bad your trip is going to be. Nah, I think maybe more into, into adulthood, yeah, but back then. No, you were good. I was just a kid, like I was just, I just wanted to get high. <laughs> That's it. It's probably like some underlying trauma or something. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Man, that underlying trauma. Yeah, you don't realize until later. Man, this this shit I'm just figuring out. I'm like, oh, that's why I do this because of this. Mm -hmm. It's his ass. <laughs> All right, go ahead and put your piece on top. Oh, my fault. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Well, that was my piece, right? It was? What's nah, this is your no? strand. Oh. <laughs> okay, so it's my turn. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh look, I didn't get a question. Oh, that's so crazy. That that's that's so crazy that you didn't get a question. So now I gotta go again. <laughs> wow. It better not be no crazy ass dares in here. Mm. You must have never seen another uh, episode. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead and pull a question. Damn, this one don't got a question on it. Okay, you safe. Okay, that's okay. Yeah, that's. That's fair. Oh, damn. Sound? Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Oh, yeah, here. Wrap it up. What happened? Hey, bro. Wrap it up, bro. What happened? Wrap it up. He trolling. Wrap it up, bro. Hey. He trolling. Cut the camera off. He trolling. He's trolling. Sound off, wrap it off, man. What's wrong? Time to go. Time to go, bro. It's Come not on. even three o'clock yet. Nope, time to go. Come on. Is he for real? Up, but have to shut the camera off. Or he trolling, bro. He trolling. You don't see it in his face? <laughs> he trolling. No, he actually works for the school. Though. What do I do, bro? You got switching here, shit. You got. You wrap it up, bro. But we're, it's not three o'clock yet. We rented out the space. You gotta go, bro. So you stop recording. Take the lights off. For real? I think it's for real. You uh, are you asking me a series? But we rented out the space, and they said it closed at three o'clock. Well, I heard a different story. We can go to it. Who and find told out. you? Misty. We spoke to Misty, and she said we can have the space. Just recording, just recording, my man. I'm recording, man. Okay, just cut. Are you for real? Do you have any hidden talents? <laughs> mm. I could do like a good British accent. Uh, British action. British accent. Oh my goodness. Hi, can I, bro? Nice. You come on these hands, you get fucking sliced up. Do a British accent for the rest of the video. A British accent for the rest of the video? Yes. All right, so what are we doing here? Okay, go ahead and put your... I said, what are we doing here? Oh, we're doing art, yep. Ah. Huh? Come again. Art yap. Art yap. 
Jenga, Jenga blocks. Playing Jenga. Jenga. All right, go ahead and put your video, your picture, your your block. Your block. Your block. <laughs> I gotta put the block on top of the other of the other block so it doesn't fall over. Yes. Thank you. My name's Bruce. What the bloody hell? Okay, my turn. That's trash. Oh, I got nothing. Oh. That's crazy. Your turn. <coughs> Um, Did you just fart? No, I burped. Passed I gulped. I, I, I mean, I burped. I gulped. It's a little gulp. gulp. I ain't gonna lie. If you if you had came in with like a like a really strong Nigerian accent, I probably would have believed you. I can't. You, I can't do it. For real? What's what's? He could have did Cuban. I think. I spoke Spanish. Yeah, he speaks Spanish good. Alright, no papi, you gotta get out of here. <laughs> you gotta get out of here. Stop the camera. Stop rolling. <laughs> mm. Favorite song you made? Ooh, wow. Okay, um, I've dived into so many different genres, and that's probably why I haven't blown up yet, because I've just been so sporadically all over the place. Um, but every time I dive into a new genre, like I kind of like master it, and then I just move on to something else, which I'm not going to do anymore. I'm going to stick with this auto tune music that I'm doing. I'm gonna stick with it. I'm gonna stick with it because I feel like that music is more consumable to the market, you know what I'm saying? Like, really, I want my target audience to be like kids, like 15 year olds, you feel me? Like 16 year olds. Because those are the people that's going, they have the most time in the world to listen to you, to be obsessed with you, to buy your merch, to pay for your shows, whatever. Watch, just consume you, kids. And so, kids like listening to music that's going, like the ADHD brain, like the, just, what am I trying to say here? They got free time. Yeah, exactly. Nothing to do but go to school and come home. Wick told me something. He was like, kids just want something that they can hit their vape to and, and jack off and then listen to your song. Like, That's real. Yeah, like we're fried as a society. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to slow down on the conscious, real lyrical music, and I'm going to make music that's consumable. I'm going to feed the machine for a little bit. I, some people might say I'm selling myself short, but... I'm you're trying to. You're playing along. Yeah, you're playing I'm along. playing along. Cause look, I could always switch it back as my audience grows in age. Cause them 15 year olds gonna be 20, 25 one day, and they they're not gonna be listening to that shit no more. But they'll be still be listening to me because I know how to change my. I, I can I can I can adjust. Mm -hmm. I can make my music more mature, more conscious, more. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, to answer the question, recently as of recently, I would say uh, probably reach. My song, that song Reach, I just dropped it. Big body, yeah, my bitch got ridiculous body. I might fuck around, catch me a body. Uh, she be like, do you love me? Ha, yeah, I told her bitch probably. I, got mm, I was off the shrooms. Really, every song that I made off the auto tune, I've done off shrooms. Really? Yeah, not a heavy amount, maybe like a gram. You microdose? Yeah, a okay. little bit, like a little, mm, mm, a little bit, a little, you know what I'm saying? How do you take your shrooms? Like you mix it in tea or you just Hell take nah. Full. I'm a G. Okay. I'd be uh, taking uh, that dirt. Like Mike Tyson. Uh, dirt, bro. Uh, I'd be eating them hoes. <laughs> I'm like hiding your bitch DM. Beat it out like the BPM. We I'm were listening to that before you came. For real? Yes, that was the song we were listening yeah, to. For yeah. real? You liked it? You know that music video I edited it. I edited it myself. Oh my god, what happened to Virgil? See when one. Oh my god, is that my YouTube channel? I gotta change my freaking banner. That's just fucking. That's from like five, four years ago. It's hard though. Who made that? Or is that came from somewhere? That came from uh, this girl online. She she's super talented. She actually kind of blew up now. But I found her when she had like three hundred followers. I was pimping her out. No 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 cap. Oh. But not sexually. Artistically, I was pimping her artistically. She would like she would do like these beautiful beautiful pieces for me like cover arts or whatever I asked for, for like five bucks, 10, 10 bucks. And she would spend like three days on it. But she was like in sixth grade, seventh grade. She made that? Yeah, well that's actually a piece of a comic strip. So she had made like five pages of a comic strip. Oh, and I really just zoomed in on one of the, one of the comic pieces. I don't I, f I forgot what that's called. Okay, so you were pipping a 16 year old. Uh, whoa, so, she was 12. Oh. She was, <laughs> she was 12, she and was 12. it wasn't sexually, it was artistically. Artistic. Artistically pimping a 12 year old. Okay, so next question. So on Off With His Head. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Whose head were you referring, referring to? Like, mm. Off With His Head. 
really the song was about like the industry. Mm, I did not know. But that. also too, I had I had beef with like a couple curly headed motherfuckers, so I was just like, I don't know. Would you name drop? I didn't. Hell no. Nah. Would you? Oh nah. No. 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 I, I'm not. Drops. I don't like causing problems. I'm not a problem starter. I'm very peaceful person. I'll try to be. Off with these heads. Go let it be. Fuck. I'm taking off with your bread. All right. Do you have ADHD? Absolutely. Me too. Really? <laughs> I think majority of the human race has it. Uh, I think it's just now, nowadays our attention spans, our attention is getting uh, separated in, in like, what's the word I'm trying to say? Actually, you know we're what? We're getting pulled in so many different types yeah. of directions. Yeah. This is and the food that we eat. Yeah. Uh, yeah, absolutely. That causes it. And the social media doesn't help. The fact that actually pay attention next time you're scrolling on your phone. Actually pay attention, like, notice how you really mindlessly, you not even paying attention, and then you can actually, like, it's, it's so fucked, it's wicked, it's so wicked how they design that shit to make you just a consumer, like a consumer, like. NPC. Yes. It's the thing, the thing is, people don't, is, like, people are not self-aware enough. They're not self-aware of what they're doing. They yeah. just go along with, they're on auto, autopilot, they're just doing shit. Oh shit. <gasps> oh, he got a day I got a tap by Frank Carl Sneaky Link. Yeah, Frank. Oh. Go ahead and pull that phone out. Do you have a Sneaky Link? How do you prank call somebody that no has your number saved? First no, of like, all. you have to, like. <coughs> Pretend. Okay, first of all, what are you gonna say to her? Like, hello, <laughs> this is Papa Jones. <laughs> no, like you have to lie to her. Like, oh shit, I got somebody else pregnant. Or, or what? Or, bitch, I just ran, I just <laughs> drove past. <I> <laughs> 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 what the? <I> just <laughs> what do y'all got going on over here? I just drove past somebody's house. No, no, I drove past your house. I see another car at, or something. Hey, who the fuck is this monster truck? Whose monster truck is this on your port on your driveway? <laughs> yeah, you gotta say something funny. If you don't want to do your sneaky link, just call a random somebody, somebody random in your contacts. Random? Yeah, and say some shit. Why should no, okay, why can, shall nobody pick up? Wait, can you? Okay, is it believable for you if you tell somebody that you got a girl pregnant? And like, oh shit, bro, I just got a girl pregnant. Da, da, da. My mom. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, that would be that would be some that would be good vid for a video though, for the video. What the fuck do you mean? I don't want to I don't uh, I don't uh. Okay, if not your mom, then somebody else. Oh. Uh. Who? One of your homeboys? Probably my uncle. Okay. Call my uncle. Damn, aunt. Damn, aunt. <laughs> damn, aunt. Got down. Oh, yeah. What the fuck? Got down. Got down, nephew. <laughs> Fuck you doing? You out there, out there fucking raw. Nobody loves me. Oh. What's up, bro? Hey, what's good, man? What you doing? Sitting down, bro. I'm just, I'm just at the house. Nice. Yeah. Um, my house? Nah, I'm, 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 at, I'm, at, I'm, at, I'm at the crib. Oh. Yeah. I don't. I, I just need somebody to talk to. I got you, brother. So there was this, What's up? There was this girl, probably like, probably like three months ago. Mm -hmm. It was on some. It was on some sneaky shit. Mm -hmm. And she just called me. She's pregnant. Yeah. You're kidding. I swear. Okay. Okay. Um, is she, does she want to keep it? Yeah. Okay. And, uh, all right. I love you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I was just told it, bro. I was just, I was just told it. <laughs> <laughs>
They they told me to prank call somebody. Holy shit, dude. Okay, cool. Shout out, shout out, Unk. I had to like compartmentalize my thoughts. <laughs> Next, I think it's my oh, turn. Oh yes, ma'am. It is yours turn. Okay. Oh wow. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. A naked block. Oh my goodness. <sighs> nah, look, I could, I could finesse it. I'll finesse it. Another dare. Mixing chug condiments. Oh, we have condiments. So you have ranch. This is what our PA got to us. Oh. Uh, ranch. Oh my God. Hunting mustard. Is this barbecue? Do I gotta drink a lot of it? You have to mix all of it together. All of it? And then drink all of it? Yeah. You fucking tripping. You have to do it. You tripping. You have to do you it. You are tripping. <laughs> Italia. <laughs> okay, how about this? I'll, I'll, we can mix all of them and I'll try, I'll try it. Like I'll, I'll like, I get a little slurp, like a little, okay, yeah. cause you know what I'm saying. Cause two people mix that all the time. People mix yeah. ranch and like honey mustard or, or, yeah, or whatever barbecue. Yeah, I, I don't personally. How am I gonna? You know, I got like a beaker, like a Breaking Bad, like Heisenberg no, beaker. You, what is this? Uh, Laffy Taffy banana. Honey mustard. Where did y'all get these? The cafe downstairs. Oh, great. A little bit of that. Look, uh, right. Okay, a little bit of barbecue, you know what I'm saying? Can't go wrong with a little barbecue. Go Goes good on everything. A little chicken nuggets, a little french fries. Sometimes you just you just doing a, a podcast interview and you just got to eat it. You just got to eat it raw with a bunch of five other sauces combined. <laughs> mm. Mm, and then rich. ranch. Yeah. I hate... How does this Why does all this shit stink? Like, this is... <laughs> This, all of this is things, by the way. Not this shit is not okay. <laughs> oh, it's thick. Like oh, 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 that looks oh. Delightful. I'm not oh, <laughs> oh. Go ahead. You have the thousand island. You're not finished. Why are you not trying? You ain't did one there. <laughs> you ain't did one there. That's bullshit. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> oh fuck! So bad. That smells so bad. Okay. Goodness. That's not. That's the, that's <laughs> illegal. Did you see that? Did you capture that? That thickness. God damn! I'm not putting that in there. Okay, okay. Just let's not play with our food. Can I use your straw? I mean, okay. Yeah, is is you gonna you gonna drink you gonna use you gonna drink that or not? No, no, no. Oh. How much do I have to eat? Just do a lick. A lick? Just a lick. Lick your whole finger. Doesn't taste bad. Some slight. Not bad. Yeah. That's actually good. That's good. Yeah. 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 All right. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Now that exhale was crazy. Ooh. I ain't gonna lie. I need a refresher. Okay. All right. There's one more. Yeah, go. Again. Yes, sir. Slap yourself really hard. Oh no, who wrote that one? You. That was our PA. You wrote that? PA, don't ever do that one again. She did it, huh? <laughs> Why are you snitching? <laughs> I let you slap me. Really? No, for real. I can't slap myself hard. My body not gonna let me. Okay. I want you to like, let's say we in a two year relationship. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get domestic. You better get domestic. Two year oh, two year relationship and I slept with your mother. You're going to hell. I'm not gonna You wouldn't slap the shit out of me? I would never hit no man like For real? You can like punch the fuck out of me and kill that's, me. That's that's a good reason to slap man. the shit out of somebody. I'm not gonna lie. Like I'll burn your clothes, but I wouldn't hit you. Okay, so you want me to hit you. Slap just slap just slap me. 
Please don't hit me back. I won't. Okay. God, please be something good. Okay, that wasn't bad, right? Okay. <laughs> yeah! And this is the last one. Oh, nothing on it. Oh, no. Whoa. Ah, uh, so that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Did you have fun? Bro, I did. Yeah, I fun? actually, actually, I did. I was a little nervous coming into it because I've had a lot of interviews where it was just like boring as fuck. But y'all had like a whole prank plan, and y'all had all these questions. Y'all did y'all's research. See cool people. Cameraman's cool. Brody over there, cool. Bro over there. The sound engineer, I'm listening. Yeah, bro. It was good. It's good. It's a good day. It's a good day. I'm excited to see what y'all do with it. And we're happy to have you on Art Yeah. Cut. <laughs> I was looking at her face. I'm just like, I can't. I couldn't keep character, bro. He, he knew you were oh, trolling. She, she, yeah, I knew he was trolling. I knew he was trolling. I couldn't, I couldn't keep it serious because, like, <laughs> I thought she was, her reaction is just like, damn, what is she acting for real? She's like, like, your acting was on point. That's what it was. I really, no, yeah, he you wasn't, didn't give us the reaction we wanted. He was like, this nigga trolling. I can say he was trolling. I can tell you he was trolling. I was in the room earlier, bro. Okay, you can stay in here if you want.